She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's lining up to see her There must be something about her features You'll find her beauty goes much deeper Once you get to meet her You see her walking down the boulevard you guys it is monday morning i'm starting off a new vlog if you're new here my name is brie welcome so today i have contracts which is at about two it's at 2:25. but and i wake up earlier today well i just want to wake up earlier so that i can do my readings in the morning and then have my contracts class so i don't have to go to bed late but i just got an email saying that we have to do this research boot camp and we have to read recommended to read five chapters by friday and we have to submit this research memo by friday and i got the email two hours before the event started so um i'm kind of like what is going on like why did they tell me before type of thing so that's why i am pretty much ready so this morning plan of me reading is not gonna be a thing because i have this research boot camp to attend and it's by westlaw and lexus nexus or whatever um i can't even pronounce properly i don't even know what it's called so that's gonna be what i'm gonna be doing for my morning so i'm at my desk area and i haven't even eaten breakfast so we are going to log in for this course then we are going to eat breakfast and then wait for soap procedure <sighs> so annoyed that like i have to do this but you know you have to do what you have to do as a law student, you know what I mean? To be successful. Right, that's my picture. I'm logged in. I'm logged in for the event. It's supposed to last one hour. Here's a little sneak peek. Um, yeah. Let's see where this goes. I guess I'm going to turn on my camera now so I can be decent. <laughs> Okay, so I just finished the Westlaw um, training and I'm really, really hungry. It was really hard to concentrate because all I can think about is eating food. I know that happens to other people too, where you're literally so hungry and all you can think about is food. Um, and right now I pulled up my contracts reading and we basically have to read 30 pages. So how my teacher does it is we do about three assignments a week. So on Tuesday, we're gonna do t assignments 10 and 11. On Wednesday, we're gonna do assignment 11 and 12. And then on Thursday, we do assignment 12. So if you include all of it together, I think it's about 35 pages of reading. Um, actually more than 35 pages, um, but I need to read 30 pages for Tuesday because he does assignments 10 and 11 and so it's 30 pages together and he doesn't get through the whole thing, but I just like to be prepared just in case because you never know how, um, how fast you'll get to the assignment. And so I'm about to start reading for that. It's about two hours before my contracts class, so hopefully I can get at least, um, 10 pages of reading done and it takes me kind of actually i have this app called focus keeper and basically you read in 25 minute increments right and after you read for 25 minutes you get a five a five minute break and after you read for 25 minutes four times you get a 25 minute break and so it's really helped me focus because i don't go on my phone and i literally just read for 25 minutes i focus for 25 minutes then i take a breath and i like stare at the ceiling or just breathe you know what i mean and then i go back to reading and if you look if you click out of the app it restarts it so then you won't get that 25 minute break so it makes you like stay off your phone and that's one issue for me because i always go on tiktok or something and so it's helped me read more it helps it's helped me be more efficient with my reading and so it's helped me a lot and i recommended that to somebody so i recommend it to all of you download that focus keeper and i got that tip from a gw law student and it's helped me so much so i'm probably gonna do that after i eat i'm gonna turn on the app focus keeper and let's see how long it's gonna take me to read right so i decided that i'm gonna have avocado toast and then i'm gonna have a little bit of coffee so i'm gonna show you guys how it looks i need a try okay guys so i'm about to make some iced coffee but i don't have a coffee maker Okay, so I'm having some coffee with some avocado toast and my coffee's looking gross. <laughs> it tastes like milk <laughs> and I don't know what I'm doing, but it's okay. It's a learning curve. Hey guys, 
guys, so I just finished um, pretty much taking a break and now I'm back at it. So I'm reading for my civil procedure class because that reading is due tomorrow. Normally, I would do those readings on Sundays, but because I was working on my legal issue analysis paper, um, I didn't get ahead this week, so I'm like, like right on time, if that makes sense. So I'm reading for civil procedure and just kind of wanted to show you guys like my study environment. Okay, so I finished reading a case and now I'm gonna get ready to work out. I'm doing a little workout for an hour. So I'll talk to you guys when I'm done working out, but I'm gonna do a Zumba, Zumba class. And it starts in about three minutes, so I need to get dressed real fast. And exercise, so I can like detox. And this is gonna be my break time, which is gonna help me with like focusing and being more like focused on my reading. Good morning, everybody. So it is the next morning and I have a Class right now, I have my fundamentals of learning class, so let's do it. Okay, so I just finished my fundamentals class and we learned a little bit about sexual affliction, emotional distress, and we have to write an open research memo about the severity element. And now I'm reviewing for my civil procedure class. I'm reviewing two cases. And then um, I'm just gonna vlog it for class. I have about 20 minutes before the class starts. And I feel like this is the most I've had, this is the most time I've had to prepare right before the class because I usually only have like five minutes. So all I do is at least switch to the app. But I'm gonna watch this YouTube video real quick so I kind of have an idea about this case. And we're just gonna go with it, we're, we're gonna wing it. <laughs> For me, I found that it said like a fundamental, a fundamental thing is to notice, it, thing is notice and to apprise interested parties of the pendency of the action and to afford them an opportunity to like present objections. Okay, right, so the court said- Okay, you guys, so I literally just got my first cold call. I kind of sensed it, but I was like, oh, it's getting, it's getting later in the class. So you probably will, will call me next class. And he called me, he was like, Miss Lewis. And I was like, oh, so I, I was like, oh my gosh, what's going on? Cause I low key, I was like what and um there was some things that he asked he was like is it in persona restriction or in rem and i was like i don't really know like i don't know i feel like it could be both so i don't know and then when he asked me i said in persona and then when he asked me why i was like i like it left my head i don't know if that makes sense but like when he first called me i was like shaking and then like i was like all right whatever and i think the rest went pretty well um so not too bad i would rate my cold call like a, an 8 out of 10 <laughs> and that was my first cold call i hope he doesn't call me again next class but i wouldn't mind talking about the next case because i actually liked it and it was kind of like easier to understand than this one this one was actually a hard case and it's so funny because i didn't want to read it yesterday and um i was like what is this case so i watched the video and something like that and so i got it so i hope he doesn't call me and then i'm done for cold calls for a, a minute before he like recalls this but i'm gonna start volunteering more because now I'm like more comfortable, wow. Now I'm like more comfortable speaking in that class. So that was my first cold call and now I'm about to log into a workshop for Lexus Nexus. And then I have an appointment with the career center so that we can talk about my career goals and she can like tell me like, oh, these things are coming up or these events are coming up with these type of people. So you should definitely go, you know what I mean? So yeah, getting ahead of the game and making a goal plan so that, you know, I can get a job at the end of the day. Okay, hey guys, so I am about to log into my meeting with uh, the career advisor at the school. And I don't know, it lasts an hour, but I don't know what we're gonna talk about for an hour. And then after that, I'm gonna be reading for my civil procedure class and um, reading assignment 12, which he said we probably won't get to, but you know, staying ahead.
Good morning, everyone. So I wanted to start off a new vlog today. I just finished my civil procedure class, which is my first class of the day on Wednesdays. And I have about seven minutes until my next class and I'm actually starving. So um, look at this lighting, zero out of 10. Try out some lights. Oh, you have to walk all over the place to have lights here. Okay, so we have some lights here. And I don't know what I'm saying. I don't really have food. And I'm really hungry. Should I just eat the rest of my Pad Thai? Because I have Pad Siu. Okay, so I've decided that I'm gonna eat the rest of my Pad Thai. And let me tell you guys something. Um, some of you might not be of age, but I got this wine called Stella Rosa. <laughs> and I actually really like it. It's sweet wine. I just leave it for like the weekends. Um, but it's this really sweet wine and it tastes like, has anybody ever had sangria if you're over the age? My fridge is screaming at me. Um, super good. I need to stop talking because I have class. I need to warm my food so that I can eat. But I'm starving. And then after I have my torts class, I have an, like a, a networking event with this firm. But like we go to the breakout rooms and this is what I'm gonna wear. My shirt looks profesh. And I kind of put on some eyebrows this morning because everybody knows this is a struggle for me. And I was about to look to see what my messages are but I don't have my watch on. Can this fridge stop screaming at me? Jeez. Closing it because this fridge screams at me. Eating pad thai for breakfast because why not? I also need to get a cup of water because I'm tired of not staying hydrated. Uh, please let me know down below if like um, drinking water is also a struggle for you. And um, here's water. Cheers to everybody. Please drink your water. Please stay hydrated. Um, we all know the benefits. Let me see. Oh, it's a group chat. Okay. All right, I have three minutes until class starts. Oh, let me tell you, show you guys my setup. Okay, so this is my textbook for some procedure. Sometimes I wear my glasses, like right when I get up. This is the supplement. So we were looking at rule four, and then we we didn't even t touch about any cases. We were just talking about like like the statutes and um, rule four of civil procedure. Oh, my makeup bag. This is my iPad, and so this is where I have my where my notes. Sometimes I reference the outline, like I was telling you guys that like some schools have outlines, and you can look at the outline outline bank. Some teachers basically talk about the same thing, but this is my um, syllabus for towards. And let me see. This is my notes, so I'm gonna go to towards so I can like see my notes. I also write down notes too, and then I have the professor on Zoom right here. But, where is my towards textbook? Oh, right here. It's my towards textbook, take it out, because it's the next class I have. Now I'm gonna eat my food, and then, how many? After towards, my towards class is at, finishes at 12.35, and the um, employer in residence thing starts at one o'clock, and then at 2.25 I have contracts. So it's a pretty busy day for me. And after I have contracts, I have civil procedure tomorrow. And then I have, um, oh, I have all of my classes tomorrow. What am I saying? So it's a really busy day tomorrow too. So after that, I'm gonna be doing a lot of reading. Let me turn off some lights because, you know, conserving electricity. So the electric bill is cheaper. But yeah, I pretty much keep myself in the dark. But um, I'll catch up with you guys. Maybe during my tour class if I remember. But just grabbing this quick bite. I don't, I normally eat avocado toast, but I don't have avocados today. All right, I'm logged in, and that's my professor, lol. Oh, Just finished towards, and I really thought that we were gonna get to um, the next assignment, which is the assignment that I read for, but we were still talking about our assignment from last week, so that means that I'm probably gonna read so that I don't have to read, if that makes any sense. I'm also gonna read for civil procedure. We didn't get as far as long as I thought. So like, it's so weird when like you read and like you get ahead, but like you didn't mean to, and so it creates less reading for you. All right, I'm about to log in. Hopefully this goes great. I'll let you guys know. Oh. All right, so I just finished the session. It was really nice. It was a really nice session and I really enjoyed it. And now I'm gonna probably eat a little bit of lunch and then I have contracts in about 40 minutes. And I was just reading for torts. I already read five pages, so I have about five pages left for torts. And that's gonna be reading for Thursday if and we get to it. I have about 10, 15 minutes before my next class, which is, um, contracts and so i'm eating some patsy i don't even know if i'm pronouncing it correctly i've actually never tasted it before i tasted it last i tasted it a little bit i think i like it so i'm gonna eat more of it and see if i like it um some people might be like girl you just ate well i only ate like three bites because it was the rest of my food but um i'm still hungry and i didn't eat breakfast per se so i'm gonna go ahead and eat that and um of course water i'm on my second water today so clap 
Yes, everybody should clap because A plus for me because I don't do quad bullets. Let's see. Their promise Already, it's ready for class. You. Mm -hmm. you know, you know, so long as the representatives. Okay, I just finished my contracts class. I don't know why I'm holding the camera like this, but I just finished my contracts class and now I'm reading first my civil procedure class. Um, we have to read up to page 294, but I doubt we're going to get to that because that's a different assignment and we haven't even done the assignment before, if that makes any sense. So I'm getting ahead so I don't have to read that much this weekend. So I just finished reading for so Pro and now I'm going to be emailing a lot of organizations because I missed the organization fair because I was reading and so I'm going to see what other organizations organizations I can join. I'm in BLSA and I'm also an SBA and I think I'm going to join ACLU, the Women's Society, maybe Immigration Law and then the Constitution, Const I mean the Business Law one. Um, that's a lot of organizations like he, but I'm going to try to join them even though I'm late. Um, because it's good to be active and also to just connect with people who have similar interests. 